317 million people, 212 million drivers. This is America. But America has been taken for a ride. There's been a monopoly on the fuel system in this country. The oil companies invented the pump. They control it. There is no competition. You gotta choose. Do you wanna go to the movies with your kids or do you wanna buy gas? It hurts. You have the ability to stop using oil right now. So here we stand. You got God with love in the hand. All cars run equally well on methanol, ethanol, or gasoline. The blood, sweat, and tears. The United States started building flex fuel cars in 1994. There are millions of cars on the road that are flex fuel. The only way you knew you had a flex fuel car is that your gas cap was yellow. What's the gas station of the future going to look like? It's going to look a lot different than today's. One of the reasons is look at natural gas coming along. It's cleaner, it's abundant right here in America. It's American. Until we have a moment of truth with ourselves, this country is destined to not only be addicted to oil, but addicted to all the terrible trappings that come with oil. What's going to break the monopoly at the pump is entrepreneurs who build alternative distribution. Spend about $100 a day in gas, now I'm spending about $20. We're under the impression that you have to change a ton of parts to make this run off of alcohol fuels. That is not true. It's possible to create compelling, affordable electric cars. That's the best part about being an American. We don't like it, we'll change it. The technology out there, the know-how is out there. We are going to be able to do this on our own.